Hey guys, today we gonna discuss the top 4 software development methodologies. To manage a project efficiently, the manager or development team must choose the software development methodology that will work best for the project at hand. All methodologies have different strengths and weaknesses and exist for different reasons. There are mainly four type of methodologies. Number one is Agile Development Methodology. Teams use the Agile Development Methodology to minimize risk when adding new functionality. In all Agile methods, teams develop the software in iterations that contain many increments of the new functionality. There are many different forms of the Agile Development Method, including Scrum, Crystal, Extreme Programming, and Feature-Driven Development. Pros The primary benefit of Agile Software Development is that it allows software to be released in iterations. Iterative releases improve efficiency by allowing teams to find and fix defects and align expectation early on. They also allow users to realize software benefits earlier, with frequent incremental improvements. CONS Agile development methods rely on real-time communication, so new users often lack the documentation they need to get up to speed. They require a huge time commitment from users and are labor-intensive because developers must fully complete each feature within each iteration for user approval. Number 2 is DevOps Deployment Methodology. DevOps deployment centers on organizational change that enhances collaboration between the departments responsible for different segments of the development life cycle, such as development, quality assurance, and operations. Pros DevOps is focused on improving time to market, lowering the failure rate of new releases, shortening the lead time between fixes, and minimizing disruption while maximizing reliability. To achieve this, DevOps organizations aim to automate continuous deployment to ensure everything happens smoothly and reliably. Companies that use DevOps methods benefit by significantly reducing time to market and improving customer satisfaction, product quality, and employee productivity and efficiency. Cons. Even in light of its benefits, there are a few drawbacks to DevOps, some customers don't want continuous updates to their systems. Some industries have regulations that require extensive testing before a project can move to the operations phase. If different departments use different environments, undetected issues can slip into production. Some quality attributes require human interaction, which slows down the delivery pipeline. Number three is waterfall development method. Many consider the waterfall method to be the most traditional software development method. The waterfall method is a rigid linear model that consists of sequential phases focusing on distinct goals. Each phase must be 100% complete before the next phase can start. There's usually no process for going back to modify the project or direction. Pros. The linearity of the waterfall model makes it easy to understand, particularly for new developers. All specifications and deliverables are spelled out before the development commence. There's no room for miscommunication information with the waterfall model as it's clearly defined in each stage. Cons. The waterfall development method is often slow and costly due to its rigid structure and tight controls. These drawbacks can lead waterfall method users to explore other software development methodologies. Number 4 is rapid application development. Rapid application development is a condensed development process that produces a high-quality system with low investment costs. The ability to quickly adjust is what allows such a low investment cost. The rapid application development method contains four phases, requirements planning, user design, construction, and cutover. The user design and construction phases repeat until the user confirms that the product meets all requirements. Pros. Risks reduction through regular customer feedback. Increased satisfaction for customers. Works well for small and medium applications. Reduces time to market. Cons. Highly dependent on a responsive customer. Requires a team of highly skilled and experienced developers. Not suitable for projects with budget constraints. That's all for now. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.